So there's this YouTube channel which is basically devoted to sniping big Bedwars YouTubers and you know cheating and then rolling them. Basically just like them rolling them with their reactions because they're usually streaming or something. Yeah it's good content I guess because they're getting their reactions so it's like hey look this is your YouTuber outside of when they're doing YouTube. No one knows that that chest has pearls. I'm out of blocks. Dude this is I feel like I've never been getting blocks lately. You know what I mean? Like but there is a fire sword in there. I don't know if I should pearl for it. Probably not, right? Maybe over here I should. Okay, we can just... Oh, there's a guy behind you, brother. Do people are so tunnel visioned on Sky Wars. If they see one person attacking them and they're getting stabbed in the back, if there's a naked stabbing him in the back, they're still going to go for the person that they're initially fighting, even though they can just two-shot them in strength chain. The most of their videos are satire because they're always like, dude, look how bad this YouTuber is, but they're blatantly cheating. So I don't know, you have to be the Jesus Christ of Minecraft to somehow beat the bee hopper that has more than three brain cells. Because aren't the people who are cheating actually good at bad words, even if they didn't cheat, they're just cheating... I mean, they could probably win without cheating, honestly. What the? That's especially hard. A cheater with game sense is basically go next. So that's probably why they're so successful, but that's probably why they, they cheat, I guess, to secure the win. Because you never know, man. Maybe the YouTuber is also just insane. Okay, nice. Uh, three pearls, I'm gonna strength chain this guy. Nice. GG. So they made a community post asking whether or not stream sniping should be allowed on Hypixel. And me being someone who doesn't only play Hypixel and watches a lot of two streamers, I thought it was pretty obvious that stream sniping shouldn't be allowed. What? Alright, 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 I'm missing all my rods. I'm missing all my rods. Why would you do that? Wait, what? You saw me try to do it before and you thought I wouldn't do it again? Strength. I can't aim. It's not even aiming, it's just tracking, which I guess is aiming. Are right, you can just chill. Do I not have... Yeah, I don't have... Prop 4, I thought I did. Is this our Prop 4? Yeah, nice, thank you. I really... Did he die too? That guy gave me the whole package, dude. He let me get the chest and he died. For free. Yeah, that is just unlucky. It's a corrupted game and that's how you play? What do you mean, wow, dude? What do you want me to do? Use my sword? Pearl on you? Aggro pearl? Bow you? Poison you? That was like the easiest situation for you to win. And you lost. Easiest situation for what he knew. He didn't know I had a fire sword, three pearls, four pop four, but that's not the point. Anyway, so they made a post asking whether or not stream something should be allowed. And most of their videos are satire, maybe all of them, but it's pretty obvious that they're satire. But the thing is, most people who watch Hypixel videos are children and they probably don't have a solid grasp on the concept of irony i mean i think the guy who runs the channel also sounds like a kid but he isn't like he knows what he's doing which is smart which is pretty rare because there are a couple youtubers oh god i can't talk like if i get hit in the game it just ruins you don't know there's a person behind you is he gonna aggro pro he could but it's a time warp now right, what's going on what's going on let me just put on my boots because that matters a lot. I have a fire sword, no healing, arrows. This guy has no pants. Surely he pushes the guy with no pants, right? Okay, now he's holding the choke point. Is he pulling up? He's not. Okay. Oh my god, I almost just died. He's probably gonna run. Wait, what? Oh my god, what language is that? Is that German? Okay. I'm sure there's a, a good percentage of people who watch that YouTube channel who genuinely think that the person sniping them is legit and he's just better than YouTubers. Which is like, he could be better, but you can't really tell because he's cheating. But without cheats, maybe. Where is the third chest? Where's this map? Is it an Easter map? What's happening? I feel like an ant. Everything feels so big and small. What's happening? Wait. Wait, I've actually never played this map before, so I can't even talk because I don't have a route or anything. So we will just go through the mushrooms. Any chests at mid? No chests. Okay. There's anvil. Enchant table. There's no chest at mid. Maybe I just missed it somewhere. What's happening? Did someone mine it? Wait, how is it? How do they make a map where there's no chest at mid? Maybe someone mined them, I guess. I've never heard of that before. No, dude. He uses better stuff. 
I hit him four more times, but he just claps me back. No, dude. Did I W tap? I think I might have just W tapped. He's full HP, dude. Look at him. Surely someone mined them. I don't think they would make a map where there's no mid chest. That doesn't sound right. This isn't Sky Wars. It's supposed to be a fast paced Hunger Games, and there has to be mid chests at Hunger Games because that's how the the actual thing is. It's got a water bucket dude, too. Okay. Interesting play. Dude, I have no armor. I have to play- Dude, listen. Okay, he's right. He's not wrong. I am a pussy, but the thing is, there's no mid chest, dude. I got bad luck, and I can't- It's just wraps. Okay, well, this guy is somehow the last one remaining. I- How did he kill someone? Well, they left the game. All right, GG's, I guess. What is this map? Is this an old map? I think this is new. Dude, why are they actually updating this? This feels so weird, dude. It's been so long since there was a new update. And now it actually happened and it just doesn't feel right. But like I said, there's probably a lot of people who watch those videos and they don't understand what irony means. So when the person typing them is like, oh, look, they're so bad. They're cheating. I mean, they probably just think that the guy's legit, you know, which, you know, it's fine, I guess. They know what they're doing, which is the smart part about it. Okay, you shouldn't. Don't do that. Oh my God. I went for the lava bucket instead of the fire sword. Oh boy. It's probably the best weapon for this map, but somehow I didn't take any KB. I'm chilling though. Don't, don't slow down the clip. You know what I mean? It's, it's not going to be a good look for me. This guy has strength. Now I have strength. He's still going. Why are you still going? You don't see that I have strength, dude. This is a corrupted game. You should be playing like your life is on the line, man. You know how much XP you get from winning that game? Yeah, I thought I was going to start running, so I was going to jump over and like, you know, he runs away. He tries to rod me, but I dodge it because I jumped over it, but he just kept pushing. That's actually Giga Chad. Okay, uh, this map is I. I got a stone sword though, which makes me feel very protected. I don't really know if I should just go straight down on this map. I don't even know what this map is, honestly. It's acting like I know everything. Is there a chest? Yeah. What the? He gets pearls? I gotta kill him so I get more pearls. Just kidding, I'm so bad. All right, look at that investment. Look at that investment. Look at all the per <laughs> dude. But hey, he had a, a sword. Look at that sword, dude. That was such a good investment. Two pearls almost dying for a diamond sword. How do I go down here without being damaged? I don't think it's possible. I'm just going to jump this guy. Unless he... Okay, there's a chest there. I forgot. He took way less KB than I thought he was going to take. There's an anvil here, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, they made a community post asking if stream stepping should be allowed, and I thought it was pretty common sense that it shouldn't be allowed. Some people were like, it should be allowed, but you shouldn't be allowed to cheat, which... I don't know, like, that makes... It's like half sense. I feel like it's common sense that you shouldn't stream snipe, because it is an unfair advantage. And the unfair advantage is information, dude. Like, you know their every step. You know how many diamonds they have, what upgrades they have, what's their bed defenses. You know everything, and they don't know anything about you, and they don't even know that you're sniping, dude. So they're just there streaming casually, you know what I mean? Just talking to their chat, maybe telling a life story, maybe listening to music, and then they just see across the map this guy is god bridging across the map. He's cross- he's, like, ignoring other teams going straight for you while you're trying to kill your side rush. You're like, well, what's, what's going on, dude? Just, just play the game. It's meant to be played. I don't know. I mean, there isn't a correct way to play Bed Wars, but there actually is. I'll be trapping myself. Don't kill, please. I can't. I'll be trapped in. Do it. I'm confused. I don't know what he wants me to do. I won't kill him, I guess, so I can talk, but... Is this guy muted? I'm just gonna kill him while he's, uh, while he's hyping. Oh, that was really awkward, because he... No water? I had no water either, so I couldn't help him. Some people said, well, if the streamer doesn't make an effort to hide their screen when they're queuing, they don't use Nick Hyder, they don't even Nick or anything, then they kind of... Then it's kind of their fault, which is true. I feel like that is true. If you don't try to make an effort to not hide your screen when you're queuing and then you complain about stream snipers, I feel like that's just kind of really dumb because there's always going to be snipers. But I don't think it should... Okay, hello? This guy's really good. How is he so good? How is he so good? Okay, I don't want to fight because we're center of attention and we both don't have good loots. I mean, I don't have good loot. Whoa! People are everywhere, but no one wants to fight. Did I get him? I got him. Let me strength chain. Let me strength chain. Please, anyone, please. Anyone. This guy. I need your pants. Thank you. I'm going to make a sharp two. Screw it. No one's going to look at me. No one's going to look at me. Yep, look at that. 
Oh my god, he has no kill effect. Or kill sound, I guess. Whoa. I don't think there's a kill effect with it. No, wait, there is, right? Because someone commented about it, and then I I had to check. Two pearls. I can just pearl when one of them is low, I suppose. But this guy is unaware. He's dead. I get him? Nice, dude. Nice. GG. So there's stream sniping and then there's Q sniping and in Overwatch, which is a 6v6 shooter game. It's not really a shooter, but basically in Overwatch is a 6v6 game. And I guess information isn't that important. I mean, the thing is, how people, what people would do in Overwatch is they would just Q snipe and then they would co close the stream, which doesn't matter that much because it's a team based game. Oh my goodness. Who are you? All right. Thank God I got like a lot of stuff actually. I got lucky there. Is he going to push? He's not. Okay. Whoa. I got like really lucky. You push again? Why? Oh my god. Any gappers? Any gappers? This is kind of a throw. I don't have arrows. But he also has nothing. Oh wait, this is the, the obby trap dude. It's the obby trap dude. Okay, yeah, he's chill. He's chill, I suppose. What if he goes rogue, dude? Because I kind of disrespected him. Well, he's doing it. This guy's actually like a sadist. Wait, he's not even dying, though. Oh, there you go, there you go. I think he's just burning. Wait, I need your loot. Wait, please. Did he just burn? He didn't even do it correctly. He just burned. <laughs> what? I don't think he knows what obby trap means. So in Overwatch, people, they would just Q-snipe. Then close the stream, because... Even if you have information, it all just goes down to aim and team play. Right? You can't really... I mean, you can't flank, but it's like... What? Why did he hesitate? Too quick. Oh my god, this guy's so aware. Wait, this guy's actually nuts. Wait, hold up. I'm finding Sasuke. Wait, I didn't know, I didn't know, I didn't know, I didn't know. He goes back- Dude, his, he's really good with a sword. Why is he just bow spamming? Okay, I guess I'll just chill here, wait for me to heal because I have no healing. I actually rolled me. He just flicked onto me and then comboed me. That was nuts. But he probably butterfly clicks. I'm not gonna lie, he probably does just butterfly clicks. So you just can't- You can't win. Did we get him? Oh, okay. Unlucky. I actually wanted to fight with him. He seemed nuts. I don't know why you played like that. I'm getting sidetracked a lot, so... Yeah, a lot of people in the comments were just like, hey, stream stepping should be allowed. You just shouldn't be able to cheat, which is like, okay, well, you can't. <laughs> I don't think anyone was saying stream stepping with cheats is allowed because cheating isn't allowed. So why would it be allowed with streams? I don't know. That doesn't make any sense. But yeah, basically in Overwatch, information really isn't that important, I guess. And high rank because everyone's just aware, right? You're just Q-sniping because you want to go against someone and you want to fight them. But you're not individually fighting them or anything, you know what I mean? You're just kind of, oh my god. Anyone else? Why did that? Why is why, what, what, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Uh, where's the iron sword? What? Oh no, wait, that's Pharaoh kit. I think he doesn't have the knight kit. Oh my god, I couldn't click. For all kit users, dude, all of them. Look at them. Probably worse than KB kit users. Okay, you can just chill out. Sniping in Overwatch is way different than sniping in a game like. Valorant, which is information is everything. You can have the worst aim ever if you have good game sense, then I feel like that's more important in a game like Valorant. So if you stream type in Valorant, then it's just like, it's pretty obvious that it shouldn't be allowed because the amount of the information advantage is just insane. And I feel like that's really similar to Bed Wars because you can see their inventory. You can see how rich they are. You know what I mean? But you have the element of surprise. This guy has no idea that he's going against some sweat. He's just casually playing on stream. And the thing about streaming is like, when you stream, you stream for the people, I think. If there wasn't a chat, then why would you stream? It wouldn't be any different than just recording YouTube videos, you know what I mean? So you're streaming to talk to your chat. You're streaming to- Did this guy try to kill himself over fall damage? Okay, I'll wait, I'll wait. Don't run away though, because that's weird. I'll wait, I'll wait. What's up? He has a stone sword. This guy's so broke, he's gonna win. If I do a telly, I don't know what a telly is. I- Oh my god, he, he probably drag clicks. He probably has like the $300 mouse. It's a hard to do bridge. Go for it. Wait, I want to like... I don't know. Is that it? Is that it? I don't care. I'll be honest. I don't care. I don't care that you can tell your bridge, bro. Like, you are cheating. It's not even about cheating or not. I just feel like if you're stream sniping, this guy is just chilling with his chat. There's no idea what's going on. And you know everything that's going on. You know all of his moves. I feel like it's pretty obvious that it's just an unfair advantage. Like, there's a reason nicking is a thing, you know what I mean? And if you're stream sniping, that just defeats the whole purpose. Is this- do I feel dumb? Maybe- I don't know what that counter-argument is, because I feel like this is just common sense, right? Look what they possibly say. 
they're streaming, so it's their fault. I mean, if they're making like a valid effort to not get sniped and they get sniped, then it's just you just can't prevent it. It doesn't matter how good you are at hiding your game. There's always going to be that one overlord guy who knows everything, all the loopholes. Sometimes it's just inevitable, and I don't really know how there's people justifying it. There's some guy said that stream subbing is cool because it makes you feel more involved with the stream, which is also really weird because you can just chat to the streamer. If you stream snipe and kill them, they're not going to be your friend. I don't know what's happening, I'll be honest. I'm just off-clicking and talking. I'm not even aiming. I'm just hoping that they just run into my crosshair. But yeah, this guy says it makes you feel more involved with the stream. But you're also ruining the stream. It's really selfish, I feel like. Because there's a lot of people who are just typing in chat. They're getting that type of attention. Then you just want to stream snipe. And I don't know. It's kind of just related to the whole stop being weird for your YouTuber's attention thing. Because it's like, well, you want to be involved. Well, that's not like... It's not positive. Can you just stop? Stop resisting, please? Sir. Sir. Dude. Does this guy not... This guy's a giga chad, I'm not even lying. Look at him, look at him. He doesn't care. He... GG's. Yeah, I don't know if I'm dumb here because I thought it was pretty obvious that stream stumping is an unfair advantage. I think if you want to get more involved, that's just selfish and it doesn't also make any sense because you're not going to develop a friendship <laughs> by stream sniping. It's kind of like a parasocial thing, I feel like, at that point. And I don't know, if you want to get more involved with the stream, how about you just make some friends and then play with your friends, dude? Like, I don't know. Like, you don't got to stream snipe. Because then there's also people who stream snipe for Hypixel SS. They stream snipe, I think, for the content. I don't really think they're, they stream snipe to feel more involved with the YouTuber or something. They do it to get content, which makes sense. The whole cheating thing is just another element added to their content, which makes it, I guess, better. Because it's not even that the... It's not even that they're stream sniping their favorite YouTubers, that they're stream sniping them and destroying them, you know what I mean? They're destroying their will to play the game. There are people who just stream snipe and they don't make it for content, they just do it, I guess, to feel more involved. Which I'm really confused about, I don't really know how that makes any sense. But then again, the average age is probably 15 or something, so I don't, there's, no, there's no rationalizing with a 15 year old. Yeah, let me know what you guys think, because I always thought that this was like an obvious thing. And I don't know if this is like a critical thinking issue, or maybe I'm just a boomer because I've always just watched streamers play games and watch them get stream sniped and it almost always ruins the fun. There's always that 1% who stream snipe and they're actually cool about it, but that's just, people would rather just get the negative attention than the good attention and those cases are just so rare. I don't know, man. But yeah, that's going to be today's video. If you enjoyed, thanks for enjoying it. I'll see you guys later. Peace.